Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. I wanted to do like a low carb type of um, lunch today. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a saute with some shrimp, some large shrimp here. They're already deveined and cleaned really well. And I'm gonna use this from HEB. They have this cranberry sauce and it's really good. You can use it on a lot of things. They have all kinds of different sauces there that you can play with. Um, I'm gonna do some videos with those sauces so you can, uh, like they have jalapeno jellies and things like that. And I can show you how I use those and cook with it. So this is really quick. I like to do like a nice little salad on the side with this. And we're going to start out with our skillet on medium high heat. And this is just a little bit, might be, uh, I'm gonna take a little bit out. I think this is a little much. Okay, so we're gonna just, this is um, some extra light virgin olive oil. Okay, I like to use the extra lights because it doesn't add any flavor. And I'm gonna add my shrimp here. It's already getting hot. I recommend that you let your skillet get hot before you add your shrimp. And after this, I'm gonna uh, use a little, and I have about 12 shrimp here. I'm gonna salt it with salt to taste, just a little bit of salt, pepper, a little bit of onion and garlic powder, and paprika and a little bit of uh, red pepper. Now, I usually just use probably a pinch or two of that, but also you can do that to taste. You can do like a fourth of a teaspoon um, depending on how many shrimp you're gonna have, you wanna increase that, but this is me, just for me. I increased my protein, usually I would only do a few shrimp, I did a few more because I'm just having a salad on the side. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna add my seasonings and I'm just gonna let this uh, cook and then I'm gonna stir this with the seasoning. Okay, so I added all of my seasonings and I'm just gonna give this a toss. Shrimp cooks really quick, so this, Shrimp is always good, like if you just want something quick. You can just have vegetables on the side if you want. I'm trying to do something more low carb for lunch today. Get this tall, I'm gonna get this nice and cooking good. And then I'm gonna dice up one garlic clove. going to add it into our shrimp. Okay, so we just continue to let that cook on medium high heat. Okay, so I have some garlic sliced here. And if you want your garlic a little bit more um, diced up, feel free. But this is going to be really delicious. And it's not too strong either. So I'm gonna add this to my shrimp. If you need to add a little bit of uh, more olive oil because you feel like it's getting too dry, go right ahead. Try not to add too much though. And then we're just gonna toss this around, let our garlic flavor infuse into our shrimp. You don't even have to use any type of sauce with this. This will be delicious just like it is. And you can do it over rice, whatever you like. Okay, so I'm gonna let this cook a little more. Because these are large shrimp, we wanna make sure they're done. Okay, so I have some diced up green onions and I used, um, we can say this is about a tablespoon, but you can place as much as you like. This is gonna cook down and just make this extra yummy. And we're gonna add it to our cooking shrimp here. You guys, I'm telling you, this is delicious. It smells good. And it's really quick. 
Okay, so now we're gonna give this a toss and continue to cook our shrimp. If you have smaller shrimp, you won't have to cook it as long, but I like to make sure my shrimp is really cooked nicely. my heat down a little bit and just let this continue to cook and get nice and delicious for about a minute okay so now we're going to add some of our cran glaze i'm sorry cran raised sauce in here and well, i would say a couple of tablespoons but you can actually add as much as you like you don't need much because it's thick and it's going to cook down. And it makes this delicious, yummy sauce. So, like, if you have some rice, it'll be so good to put that, put this over that. And again, this is what it looks like here. And I get this from HEB. They may sell it at other grocery stores. So, we're going to let this continue to cook down. This meal doesn't even take 20 minutes to do, from start to finish. Okay, so I'm gonna turn my heat back up to medium high and I'm just gonna let this simmer down, okay? Okay, so it doesn't take long. It takes you about two or three minutes for it to cook down to where it gets thick. You want your uh, sauce mix to be thick and your shrimp are nice and cooked. You see the garlic in there and also your green onion. You could add some more green onion on it if you would like towards the end. And you can also use like more pepper, more hot pepper. You can even cut peppers in here if you want it to be more spicy. Okay, so now I'm gonna serve up. Okay, so here's the finished product. I garnish with a little bit of green onion. This is gonna be so yummy. Just imagine if it, if it was over some delicious rice. So good. Okay, and I'm pairing it with a salad today. I cut up a little bit of red bell pepper, green bell pepper, and then I have my lettuce and tomato. Pretty simple salad. And I'm gonna pair it with just a little bit of Ken's Creamy Caesar Light Dressing. Okay, you guys, thank you so much. Love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much and have a blessed day.